Shemuel Rishon 1 Samuel 8 And it came to pass, when Shemuel was old, that he made at his sons judges over Yashadael. Now, the name of his firstborn was Yoel, and the name of his second, Aviyahu. They were judges in Be'er Shiva, and his sons walked not in his ways, but turned aside after lucre, and took bribes, and perverted judgment. Then all the elders of Yashadael gathered themselves together, and came to El Shemuel unto Ramah, and said unto him, Behold, you are old, and your sons walk not in your ways. Now make us a king to judge us like all the nations. But the thing displeased Shemuel when they said, Give us a king to judge us. And Shemuel prayed unto Yahuwah. And Yahuwah said unto El Shemuel, Hearken unto the voice of the people in all that they say unto you, for they have not rejected you, but they have rejected me, that I should not reign over them. According to all the works which they have done since the day that I brought them up out of the Mitzrayim, even unto this day, wherewith they have forsaken me and served other Elohim, so do they also unto you. Now therefore hearken unto their voice, howbeit yet protest solemnly unto them, and show them the manner of the king that shall reign over them. And Shemuel told Eth all the words of Yahuwah unto the people that asked of him a king. And he said, This will be the manner of the king that shall reign over you. He will take Eth your sons, and appoint them for himself, for his chariots, and to be his horsemen. And some shall run before his chariots. And he will appoint him captains over thousands, and captains over fifties. And will set them to ear his ground, and to reap his harvest, and to make his instruments of war, and instruments of his chariots. And he will take eth your daughters to be confectionaries, and to be cooks, and to be bakers. And he will take eth, rather, and he will eth take your fields, and eth your vineyards, and your olive yards, even the best of them, and give them to his servants. And he will take the tenth of your seed, and of your vineyards, and give to his officers and to his servants. And he will take eth your men servants and eth your maid servants and eth your goodliest young men and eth your asses and put them to his work. He will take the tenth of your sheep and ye shall be his servants. And ye shall cry out in that day because of your king which ye shall have chosen you, and Yahuwah will not hear you in that day. Nevertheless, the people refused to obey the voice of Shemuel, and they said, Nay, but we will have a king over us, that we also may be like all the nations, and that our king may judge us, and go out before us, and fight at our battles. And Shemuel heard at all the words of the people, and he rehearsed them in the ears of Yahuwah. And Yahuwah said to El Shemuel, Hearken unto their voice, and make them a king. And Shemuel said unto the men of Yashadael, Go ye every man unto his city.